Manual Long Range Locator System, Manual LRL. In the Manual Long Range Locator System, the search settings are adjusted manually by the user according to his preferences before the start of the search process. And many options can be customized. Device installation. One. Connect the antennas into the sockets in the device as follows. Two, connect the IMTU probe to the device. Make sure that the lock of the antennas unit is open so that they are movable during use. Three, use the power socket on the bottom of the main unit to connect the battery. Note, immediately after entering any search system from the main menu, a video will appear which will notify the device's assembly steps. System Selection To start control long-range locator system, select this system from the main menu and then press the OK button. After system selection, a screen will appear which includes a couple of tabs to set the settings for the system, which are Target. It expresses the type of target to be searched for and can choose from predefined types Silver Platinum Iron Gold Veins Gold Treasure Gold Ore Gemstone Diamond Copper Cavity, Bronze. The target type is chosen by using the left-right arrow buttons and pressing OK. Distance. The user can specify the distance to search within the search process. This means that the user can search within a radius of this distance. And this distance starts from 250 to 3,000 meters. The distance value can be changed using the left-right arrow buttons and pressing OK. Note, the user can change the distance value by 250 for every press by pressing the up-down arrow buttons and by 50 meters by pressing the left-right arrow buttons. Depth. It is the value of the maximum depth that the device can search. The depth value can be set by choosing a value from a set of predefined values within the range from 0 to 50 meters. Note, the user can change the depth value by 10 meters by pressing the up-down arrow buttons. and by one meter by pressing the left-right arrow buttons. Scan. After completing the previous settings, select the scanning tab using the arrow buttons, right and left. Then press the OK button 
above the Start Scan button. How to use. After the setup is completed, hold the device as follows, and to make sure that you're holding the device fixed to your body without moving. Then stand in the search area and press the OK button on the button board to start the scanning process. When you press the OK button on the button board in the previous window, the following screen will appear, which includes the following elements. Compass indicates the geographical direction of the device, north, south, east, or west. Antennas indicator. It is a semicircular indicator. The zero in the middle expresses the value of the angle of the inclination of the antennas, according to the direction to the right, or left within a range from 0 to 90 degrees to the right and 90 degrees to the left. Indicator arrow. It is a red indicator that moves according to the angle of inclination of the antennas and indicates the specified value on the semicircular indicator. Alignment tool. It is a color graded indicator from top to bottom and the zero point in the middle of it expresses the angle of inclination of the device from the horizon, and the correct values are shown in green. During the scanning process, the antennas will move left and right according to the target being detected. The user should change his direction according to the direction of the antennas. Every movement will appear on the screen to make it easier for the user. The user must only follow the movement of the indicator arrow to get the correct direction. Keeping the device in a correct position with respect to the horizon. 